The question is, why is Abraham Lincoln wearing short shorts? Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of The Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge. So, we are pregnant currently. Oh yeah. But we're only in the first trimester of pregnancy, which is bad. But it also gives us time. Go get Christina, a boyfriend, finally. Because, you know, she hasn't had anyone yet. She hasn't found anyone that she wants to be in love with. So what I'm going to do in this episode is choose someone to move into our town that she can date. So the choices now of choosing who to move in, quite difficult. There are a lot of sims here. Oh my gosh, Abraham Lincoln. Let's do it. Abraham Lincoln is gonna move into this house. <laughs> a president living in Prick Cabana. The question is, why is Abraham Lincoln wearing short shorts? Those booty shorts though. <laughs> I never took him for a man that would do that. But let's buy him some stuff so that he's not living in this house in just a complete, in an empty shell. So let's go. I'm gonna just give him the basics because I can't really be bothered seeing as though he's not gonna be living here very long. So here we have it guys. This is Abraham Lincoln's house and it is very basic. <laughs> we didn't have a lot of money to work with but I also didn't want him just living in a house with absolutely nothing. So at least he has a nice kitchen. I mean I wouldn't mind this kitchen but yeah the bedroom is very very basic and the living room is also pretty basic but at least he has a jukebox because I know the president likes listening to music. So I am gonna get the president and Christina today. I know, this is insane. We have Abraham Lincoln living in our Sims world. Very crazy, very crazy indeed. And he lives in a really, really small house, which he's not gonna live in forever because I'm sure him and Christina are gonna move out. Their relationship might take a while to blossom. We can't force that. So let's go ahead and go back to Christina. Okay, Christina, today is your lucky day. You are gonna go and date the president. <laughs> Are you excited? You should probably eat first though. Meanwhile, we'll actually go and age up Scott Summer because he can, he's been a baby now. So let's age him up into a child and let's see what he looks like. Apparently his bed was inaccessible, so let's try again. Here we go, what's he gonna look like? <gasps> Oh my gosh, he's adorable! He's so cute! Okay, let's have Wizkid and active! There we go. He looks so much like Amy! He's so cute! Oh, bless him! Okay, first of all, kid, you gotta go learn a skill straight away. That's it. You play on that, and you get to level two. And when you do, come back to me. <laughs> Let's check on the other kids as well, because you know what? We should probably get their homework done and try and help their skills because they're never just gonna get the grades that they need at school. Ooh, I think this is a book that she actually stole from school. Bad kid, don't steal. Okay, we gotta take Christina out of here before the musical prodigy, which is Scott, ends up making her want to die because the violin is so bad. She's also feeling pretty bored, so let's go. Here we are at the president's house. Also, how sad is it that we just go to someone's house, knock on the door, and then we can get with them in The Sims? That would never happen in real life. If someone just knocked on my door and came in, I would be mad. I would be real mad. Okay, watch Simda with Abe. Simda? What is Simda? Hello, we just met you, but we're coming in here. Oh no, what's going on? Is it because we're so bored? Are we annoying him? I don't think we get on at all. This is very awkward. Why is this so bad? Change the TV. Okay, we learned that he's good. This is inappropriate, please stop. We were only taking a bath in your house. What's wrong with that? Oh my gosh, he just got into bed. Can we sleep in the bed with him? No, he gets out. <laughs> Why are we in his bed? This is inappropriate, please stop. Okay, well we tried to get to know him a little bit better. Our bar is like half full, but it just wasn't working out today. So we're gonna go back home actually. And then from home, we can invite him around to our house because we've already visited this place and it's boring and we're tired, so we gotta go home. Okay, so we're back home now. And I feel like we're in a better position to maybe hang out with Abe a bit better now that we're home so that we can rest and go to sleep and maybe call him over here because it just wasn't working out at his place. Maybe it's because his place sucks and we weren't impressed. But all of the kids are gonna go to school now and then we're gonna try again. Lucifer says, hey, I heard you became friends with Abe Lincoln. I heard he's alright. <laughs> what the heck? 
heck? How does Lucifer know him? That's what I want to know. He literally just moved in. Oh no, the garden's looking a bit dry. Let's go ahead and get the gardening club around. Also in the next episode, I'm definitely, definitely going to move into this giant mansion. What do you guys think about it? I think it's going to be a really nice house. I'm not sure how many bedrooms it has, but it just looks real nice. And I think it may be furnished. So if we can get in here furnished, I'll be so happy with that. But it might cost a bit more to move into it furnished actually so we're gonna have to see about that i'm also not sure where i'd put all of my crops it seems like the lot is a bit small so there'd be nowhere to have a garden i don't know what this is some sort of outhouse maybe we could get rid of that i'm not sure it looks cool though do i really want to risk getting rid of this cool building dangerously tired could he die from being so tired is that a thing elders don't have the stamina they used to at the moment dimitri is exhausted continuous strenuous activity could be fatal right now. What? Fatal? What are you doing? You just sat down. How is that hard work? Okay, he's not dangerously tired anymore and he's literally done nothing. This makes no sense. What? You just went for a pee. I'm not even going to question him anymore. He's confusing the heck out of me. So who's our next victim going to be? I honestly can't remember who we've had a baby with and who we haven't recently. So I think from now, I'm just going to start moving new sims in and using them instead. Also, someone left a really cool suggestion of you guys creating sims so that I could involve them in this series. So if you want to create some sims and upload them to the gallery, let me know the names of them and whatever they're called and how I can find them in the comment section and I will use those in my series. I did this when the series like first started and it was so cool to see like who you created or who you suggested. So yeah, make sure to let me know about that and maybe you'll see your sim in this series. Okay, kids, gonna need to do your homework and get your skills up. Let's go. I'm gonna need that violin again. I know everyone's gonna hate it, but we gotta do it. Oh no. Oh, we should totally get Abraham Lincoln round quick. Let's ring him. Let's call him over. The garden's done. Looking good. Where is Abe? There he is in his underpants. What the heck? Why? Why are you going in the pool, dude? Okay, end the gathering. And Christina, we need to come over here and get with this guy. Oh, they hugged. Come on, guys. We need to get together. They seem so bored when they talk to each other. I don't want them to be bored. Oh my gosh. Are we asking if he's single? Kind of awkward because, you know, our mum and dad are in the same room, but we got to make a move quick before he goes home. He is single. Of course he is. We moved him in. Anyway, let's flirt. Let's do a little cheeky old flirt in front of our mum. Come on, we got to flirt. Do this. Offer him a rose or something, girl. See if he accepts it. Because we're, like, we're really good friends now, so hopefully we can take this a little bit further. We can date Mr. President. Oh no, we also have to pay the bills. <laughs> I didn't realize. Exchange numbers. Let's hope he's impressed. He is. Oh my gosh, he's so flirty right now. First kiss. Let's go. Oh, so cute. Try for a baby in a bush. Classy. Let's go. <laughs> That's hilarious. What is this? Swan dive into the pool. Your sim wants to show off their elegant swan dive. <laughs> no, we're not going to swan dive. They're going to make a bush baby, guys. They did it. And now we're going to ask him to be our boyfriend. Look, they're thinking about babies and houses. Yes. It's so cute. I'm not sure if Abraham Lincoln had a kid. But if they did, please let me know. And I shall name that child after the child that Christina is probably going to give birth to. Because we can't actually try for a baby anymore. So that makes me think that Christina's pregnant to the president. Okay, let's get married. May as well. Well, we'll get engaged first. He said yes. Oh, he's so cute. Okay, and now I think we're going to get married. Elope immediately. Beautiful wedding out here in the garden. Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> it makes it so much funnier when you like zoom out and see the whole neighborhood just getting on with life while these two are getting married. That is legit so funny. Well, this is really cute. Moving in together. Can we even move him in? Oh, we can't. Okay, we're gonna have to move them out into their house for now. And then we're gonna move Christina and him into Newcrest. So here we have it. The president and Christina in their own house. But yeah, we are gonna make them move out so that they can live in Newcrest and hopefully have a better house than this because it's kind of small. Also don't even know where the president is. I'm pretty sure he's still at our other household, which is very strange. Okay, he's here now. 
and he's happy. Anyway guys, I think this is where I'm gonna leave today's episode of The Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge. We managed to finally get Christina hitched. I'm so happy. She doesn't have to be alone anymore, but they are living on the $69. But yeah guys, if you did enjoy this crazy episode of The Sims 4 100 Baby Challenge, do make sure to leave a like. In the next video, Amy should be giving birth to a baby, so make sure to leave some name suggestions and upload some Sims to the gallery. Hope you're all having a wonderful day, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!